we're on this computer. All right, so let's cover your GM at Camp's Chicken Grill email. Um, log into Gmail just like you would. If you ever need to admin it, I don't, I don't run this for you. Google does. I just set it up for you because it's kind of hard, okay? okay. Um, hit manage this organization, okay? And in here, uh-oh, it's going to camps. Oh, boy. Um, yeah. Uh, what was the password you put in there? From before? Uh, well, you said you reset it here at GM. Uh, yeah. Hold on. I don't know if I, 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 I don't know. I, I did my password the other day for the Go Agency. Yeah, yeah. No, you didn't log in here yet then. No. Um, let me. Uh... Yeah, I didn't log in that one. All right. Uh, this is going to be a little more challenging. Because I usually just uh, we can always figure that out later. That's not a big deal. Well, you're set up as your your email set up as if you forgot your password, it will come to you. So yeah. um uh account scoodle camps on chicken grill. Did I not save it? Uh I do have your Twitter and Instagram. You guys uh um have you recovered those? No. Okay, we'll work on that. Um, all right, I think it was change me. Uh, I think I texted you. Let me, let me, let me. Uh, let me see if I uh, James. Let's see your passwords protected. All right, I'm gonna just put change me in here. Hopefully that worked. Oh, how awesome is that? <laughs> it worked? It worked, yeah. Because I put, hey, it's changed me. Don't forget to change me. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I'm going to save that. All right, we're good. So when you're in your dashboard here, and this is managing it, um, your billing's here. Everything's here at your home. Um, I know it looks kind of complicated. Support is over here if you need support. Um, they're just billing you four bucks or whatever. Um, I have nothing to do with it. Once you change this password from change me, like it's you and Google now, right? Uh, man, and they, and what you get with this, um, it looks like they've changed some things here. Security rules, building data, admin, account settings. Where's billing? They move it. There it is, billing. So here's your subscription. You're paying uh, paid service starts in one day. Um six dollars a month and here's all you get with that um you get over here you get drive right so you got google drive you store all your files here in the cloud right um and you've got you know all the features of you know everything you know your youtube channel later whatever it's worth the six bucks plus your professional got an email to your domain right um so change me as the password all lowercase um and then gm at camps chicken grill any questions no. No. Nope. Right, cool. I'll get out of that. Let's go to Go Agency dashboard here. All right. So the value of this is uh, really simple. Um, local businesses um, need the same tools that big corporations use to manage their business. Now, I mean, obviously, if anyone comes to you and say, say that they're a social media expert, um, just keep in mind that they're only an expert for a month because everything changes, right? <laughs> so it's hard for a local business to keep up with all this, right? And, and I've got, you know, and I, I've got several friends that own businesses and they come to me for help. You know, people are charging like $300 to $900 to post, you know, just and manage your social media um, because it, it can't be time consuming, right? Um, so you can access all this from your phone. And let me just step back for like one second and show you how the buying cycles kind of change. You know about reviews, right? You don't buy anything on Amazon now without looking at the reviews, right? So, right? Yep. I mean, for sure. So you guys have a great reputation. So this reputation piece, this is what a local business really needs, right? They, they, sometimes they need to do advertising. Listings are super important. When somebody mentions Alexa or Google and they ask for chicken, do you come up? We take care of that for you. Your reputation management, um, and you're back here. The listings um, are all your listings. Uh, we're submitting you to, you know, 114 sites. 
um, the Google voice, everything. Customer voice, it's a lot like your loyalty. Um, we can import, um, uh, you know, an email and text people from here as well. It's not completely loyalty like the pad, but it does ask for reviews. It's not like you need reviews. Everybody loves you guys. And then social marketing, um, this helps you manage all your social in one place. Um, the website would be linked here, but it's not right now. Advertising, anytime you do any kind of advertising. Let me tell you, Jam, just try to avoid, uh, you know, boosting posts for 20 bucks. Um, it's, a, it's a waste of money. I'll tie it in here and show you. Um, if you need to boost, boost it to your local area and, you know, only do it for two days and don't spend more than $10. Um, mm. If you need an advertising campaign, talk to me. Um, I'll set you up right um, on how to do that. And then reputation management. And we can move these things because really this is most important. And then, then you're yeah, my wife's been, nira has been handling all the social media stuff. So, <laughs> okay. Yeah, I've been boosting. Okay. Well, that's okay. Um, boosting mm -hmm. is fine. Um, what we need to do then is connect your advertising and then you can see um, the results of your advertising because it's kind of hard to see in Facebook. Um, do you have a lot of experience with boosting and things like that? Or is this your first time? No, first okay. time. Yeah. And so that's how Facebook made its money. I mean, I've been in uh, Facebook advertising since 07. Um, they made it really easy to take $25 from every business owner by pushing that button. But make yes. sure that make sure it does some things. And I can teach you that separately when you boost it. Um, make sure your target audience is right. Um, two days is really all, that, all you're going to get. And 10 to 15 bucks, depending on how many thousands we're going to reach. Um, really, you're looking for clicks. Uh, you know, they made up this word engagement, you know, that you'll hear in social media all the time. But yeah. At the end of the day, it's conversions and you really want people to come in. And that's why the pad is so important, because, you know, in City Grow, we're going to show you the conversions. People get a text, they bring it in. That's a conversion. Right. Um, did did people come in because they saw your post? That's kind of hard to track unless you're doing mm -hmm. offers and things like that. Right. Um, so let's look at. Um, for example, so these are all the tools that we're giving you. Um, you're on this 50 uh, toolkit, which gives you all the express and the website right here. Um, and then if you ever want to look at the comparisons, um, this is this is uh, what, what the difference is between the pro. So right now you guys are just Facebook and Google, but if you wanted to do Instagram, Twitter, and LinkedIn, um, then you may, you may need to upgrade to the pro, right? Um, so let's take a look at that and see how it works and how it's going to save you time. So, well, all you do is if they're already connected, which I connected them, you're fine. Um, you can actually one of one, one of one. Okay. Yeah. You can, you can do multiple Facebooks with pro as well. All you do is hit compose right here and you'll see it will post to Google my business, which you're probably not doing and Facebook. Um, and if you had Instagram, Twitter and all these other things that would, would do it all right here. You just import your picture right here, okay? Um, and then put the message right here. You can use emojis or whatever, um, opening, you know, new barbecue, whatever, right? Does that make sense? And mm -hmm. then here's your preview over here. And you can schedule it um, or save draft. And uh, what's cool about it is you'll, what, you know, instead of just going in and doing it, where's our calendar? Uh, there you go. So there's your calendar. Um, you can see it's already showing your frequency. So two or three times a week, you can just sit in here in an hour and schedule out your post for the whole month. Right now. Nice. The other thing is, um, are you planning to do Instagram and Twitter? I think my daughter set up an Instagram account the other day. I thought um, you guys already had one though. Um, I don't know. She, we, we, we started, they started doing the whole social media stuff, whatever, uh, you know, while I was running uh, the place. So <laughs> let's see here. Can't. I'm not a big social media guy. So I hear you. Um, but I mean, I'm so a believer now because Sunday, when we did a lot, uh, a lot more revenue on Sunday, a lot of people, all, a lot of them were just coming in because someone else posted something mm -hmm. and gave a great review so they're looking at the review yeah. and said man i'm gonna go to try this chicken yeah so the reviews are the reviews are money for you guys and that's where i wanted to show you the next tool so that's social posting um hold on let me get in here um you know pro let's just take a look at a comparison real quick i'm sorry i'm bouncing around am i making you making you dizzy yeah <laughs> okay um so 
this is the difference. You can schedule 20 at a time, unlimited here. Um, and then click, these are the differences right here. You don't need any of this stuff. So you're starting right. And where am I? I'm lost, I'm lost. There we are. Um, you know, monitor competitors, the whole nine yards there as well. Um, you can also, um, I don't think you can, can you respond in here? I thought you could respond, which is really nice to be able to respond. Yeah, I, thought you, I thought you had uh, responded. You had shown me on one of them. Yeah. Overview. So you, you can um, customer posts. You should be able to No, I guess that's only a pro don't upgrade here. I've got a whole package deal. Um, if you guys want to do that now, reviews are here in reputation management. Any, any questions about social, how to use no. that tool. Okay. Um, again, it's, you want to, you want to post to Google my business. Okay. You understand this here, right? Um, mm -hmm. so camps, let's see. Um, so it will save you time rather than going in both places. You can use the tool and, and post to Google maps as well. Um, in the reviews, here's your reviews. Um, check this out. Um, one day ago, five stars. Check out how easy this is. Already pre-written for you. Cool. You can pick one of these. There's tons of templates up here. Um, so you can even, a lot of times it says their name. Eric, there you go. See, it even said their name and customized it. Uh, is it okay to respond to that one? Sure. Boom. Done. Well, I thought. And so um 23 for reviews on pro i mean trip advisor yelp maybe in pigeon fours they're trying to make a case for it but i'm telling you it's like a thousand to one on google and it's maybe 10 times more on facebook right mm -hmm. so google reviews are bigger than facebook reviews and then very small are yelp and so we have google. 23 re reviews right now uh, on businesses not available on probably Yelp or over here, okay. but you have to go and claim those. Um, you may have to okay. contact Yelp and TripAdvisor um, because it's probably linked to the old GM at Camp's Chicken and you got to prove that you're the owner, which won't be hard to do. Um, the other cool thing about this is you can respond to Facebook right here. The food was so good. Mm -hmm. um, so look at this, um, short but sweet, we're grateful. Uh, and then you can just respond to that. So this saves you the time right here. Okay. Um, and then we can, in the pro version, you can set up templates and give it to an employee later um, and, and, and just pre-approve them. I'll go ahead and respond to that. If you guys need us to do that, we can work out a deal um, where we can respond. We can do all your posting, respond to all the comments, all that. If you decide just you don't want to do it, you don't have the time for it, we've got people to do that for you, okay? And it's, okay. All, it's all in our cart here. Um, when you go here, uh, let me see, let me go back. We have all that, you know, anytime website design, whatever you need, it's all right here in our cart. Um, just talk to me about what's, what's the best one. And we have, we have all these things you can just buy. Like if you need 10 K followers on Instagram, we got you. If you need your social media redesign, we got you. Um, you know, so yeah, anything so, you need, but I haven't logged in yet. Okay. So yeah, anything sure. you need. I'll try to, you know what, I'm going to, I'm going to try to log into camps Instagram right now. If you have an Instagram already, you'll be better off using this one. Don't you think with, I mean, how? Yep. The other one only has like four followers. It's yeah. Camps underscore chicken. Let me, let me try to log out here and let me log switch accounts. Okay. Uh, that's not going to work. Um, manage accounts. Oh boy. Well, let me try that later then. Um, I'll try to get access to that and change the email to GM. Is that cool? Yep. At camps. All right. Um, all right. So social reputation, we can put this re review display widget on the site. That's kind of nice. Shows your reviews, um, response templates, uh, Q and a, um, this is really good. What are the COVID safety practice five months ago? Um, you know, no one answered that, but it would be really good to just come up with your own questions and put them in here. So like, I'm gonna give you guys a little bit of homework. What kind of questions are you getting now already 
Jam. Um, Can I bring uh, my dog? Questions or are questions are uh, a lot of them are you know are we going to have the drive through or if we're going to uh, be doing deliveries and if we're going to have you know we're going to have a, a third party uh, delivery service and stuff things like that. Those Dude. are the que those are questions for a couple of uh, for the three days we're open. So, um, so post and then you can answer it. And then you go answer the question. Do you have a drive through? And then we plan on having, think of, think of the time it's saving them and you. When you start uh, getting okay. frequently questions, they're gonna see this on Google, they're gonna see this on Facebook, okay? Yeah, so when yeah. you do it here, uh, we plan on having one soon or not. What, what was the answer? What's uh, your answer? Did somebody respond or something? He's responding to his own question. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. yeah, we are planning on having it soon. Yes. A drive up window. Mm -hmm. And based on uh, COVID coming around again, I think, you know. Uh, okay. There you go. And so people are going to see that now. Um, competition, missions, that's all different but this is the basic stuff just get you know respond to reviews and you'll get emails um you know it's super easy to do right one year ago yeah, I've, been getting, I've been getting emails every you know pretty much every night i guess there's some digest whatever that comes through i guess yeah it comes from you though yep it does um and it, it it gives you what to do and then these old ones i would just cut and paste like this is one day ago, one day ago, one day ago. I mean, I, I'll, I'll just do them real quick for you if you want. Or do you want to take more time? And no, no. Okay, you okay. Can. I mean, a lot. Yeah. Thanks for the amazing feedback. Okay. So what I was gonna say, um, here, here, adding comment. Huh. Did my internet go down? No. All right. Here we go. Should we be getting in the habit of responding to these? Um... Yeah, I mean, Google and Facebook grade you on how quickly you respond. So, okay. yeah, um, definitely. So these six months ago, okay, what I would do is um, I would come up with a different one. Like, uh, we're open again in Knoxville or? Yep. Thank you for your review. How about, how about this? At our new location. Yeah. New location. Um, in Knoxville, right? Yep. 7201 Chapman Highway. I'm just going to say they can look at the. They can look at the map in Knoxville. Um, yeah. Cause cause when you how come so many people still ask where we're located? Uh, we'll, 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 we'll talk about that in one second. Let me, uh, let me finish that. That's in listings and I'm going to show you, uh, all right, there you go. get these cleared out yeah you guys did really well on the reviews with the 5-0 um all right there you go um so that's reviews pretty easy to to manage that and then let's talk about listing builder um this is now, instead of going to Facebook, instead of going to your Google Places, again, um, we should start syncing. Um, but we got to finish the information. Um, so let's take a look at this. So Google My Business, we're supposed to be syncing now. Um, update your business profile. Uh, let's see here. All right. So. Let's make sure all this is right. Camp's chicken grill and grill, right? Is that technically what it is now? Yep. Um, common 
business name. Uh, camp's chicken. That's good. So that's the right email. That's the right website now. Um, we, we got three of these. What else can we do? Barbecue? Barbecue, yeah. There we go. Oh, I updated it on Facebook. I put barbecue, southern, and um, chicken. Okay. Let's see what else is on chicken. You get three chicken wings. What'd you say, southern? Southern. I like it. Okay, those are the three. Now, this will overwrite Facebook and overwrite Google. My, it's all in one place. So if you have an hour change, you haven't go here and change it, and it will sync up, not only with Google and Facebook, but all 150 sites that I was talking to you about, right? Um, so let's get, this is going to be important. Um, so when you change your hours here, um, they change everywhere. So you have special holiday hours, business open or closed or open, um, online store only, no. Contact delivery, no. Uh, delivery yet? Not yet. Uh, but we'll do, do Uber, Uber Eats and that We're kind of do stuff. We're going to do like uh, uh, Grubhub and Uber Eats. You know. All right, so change that as soon as you're doing Grubhub, right? Um, okay. In-store pickup and takeout, yes. Yes. Curbside? Yes. yes. Okay. Serves dine-in, yes. yes. Payment methods, what do you got? Credit cards and cash, I mean. Cash. No check? Uh, no checks, no. Diners, Discover. <laughs> Uh, we have Discover. MasterCard. Yep. Visa. Visa. There we go. Yep. Very important to get check all these services offered. Uh, chicken. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just do that. What else? Uh, do we have Do we have parties, trays, and large parties? What? Catering. We do catering. Catering. catering yep. That's part of the website. I don't know. Um. And then let's let's just mess with them here. Camps, chicken, and grill. I'm gonna fill out everything that you can. Uh, is there any landmarks near you? Yes. What? Waffle House. And uh, what's the other thing? The Bayou. Bayou Bay. Bayou Bay. I spelled it right. Bayou Bay, right? Yeah, it's B-A-Y-O-U. Yep. Cool. Uh, is, is there anywhere uh, you can add that we also serve like um, hamburgers? Yeah. Well, we should have put that in the, instead of Southern. Ah, uh, okay. Well, chicken wings, I don't know. I feel like barbecue is your main one out of the three, right? Yep. Barbecue but and Southern and then maybe hamburgers? see but yeah i don't want it to be chicken though uh let's put it here hamburgers uh, catering oops you can't spell hamburger there it is all right um okay so save yes you have a fax no okay all right, so this will sync hours. All you gotta do, okay, yep. <laughs> so what are the hours gonna be right now? Sunday, um, I, was, I was gonna do all 11 and nine, but well, I guess Friday and Saturday were open 11 and 10. Mm -hmm. but I don't know if it's gonna do anything. So I think just 11 and nine all week. Yeah. Let's just do that. Except Monday and Tuesday. Monday were and closed. Tuesday were, were closed for right now. Okay. So, what did you say? Sunday and Monday? No, Monday and Tuesday were closed. Okay. And the rest of the days, 11 to 9 is fine. Why is this? Did I, what did I screw up over here? What did I, closing must be after opening time? 11 a.m. To 9 p.m. What, what's wrong yeah. with that? What, what in the world is going on? I'm just gonna hold on. Why would it not take? I'm gonna save, go back. It's weird, that was glitchy. 
Uh, nine, right? Okay. <laughs> that was weird. <laughs> Sometimes, you know. Monday and Tuesday. Uh, what is it doing? What is the world? Let me see here. Okay, so you got to select it. I guess that's weird. That has not worked like that before. That is very weird. Okay. All right. All look good. Yeah, Eleven and nine. Yep. Yep. All right. Pushed. Um, appointment settings, no. Holiday hours, no. Social. Um, I'm going to try to get that. Uh, I'll take care of this. I do have your Twitter. Um, one second. Let me try to get in Twitter real quick. Um, camps. One second here. Let me log out. Um, add an existing account. Camps. Chicken. Hopefully that other guy didn't steal our social media. All right, I got I got into I got into Camp's Chicken. So what I'm going to do here is, oops, going to go profile, and then what we're going to do is change that password. I mean, change that. Yeah, that logo is different. That was the original one. Yeah. Let's see. How do I get the to it? Like added the burgers and stuff, so we wanted to have the settings. But the color of the chicken is different, too. Isn't it? Isn't it orange now? Yep. <laughs> Same it is. Yep, yep. No, it's orange. Yeah. It's white and black, actually. Mm -hmm. Four. Settings. Thank you. Um, let's go ahead. Now, see, the other great thing about the tools is you don't have to mess with logging in here and passwords for three different people, four different people. You know, I'll give you access to the Go Agency, whoever, you know, an employee, if you get if you do that and everybody, you don't have to, you know, log into Instagram from other places. Um, I'm trying to find email here and I cannot find it. Connected accounts. Yeah. Where is it? Where did it go? We got to change that email. Please enter your password. Okay. Uh, okay. That's what happened. There we go. Ah, I already did this for you guys. Okay, good. So you'll be getting emails um, at GM to reset that password if you need to. Um, let's, I'll send you the password to this because eventually you'll want to connect it to the tool. So we're good there and I'll take care of Instagram. Okay. All right. Um, but you should be good at, uh, did I change the email? Did I change the website? Make sure I changed the website. Yep, I did. I, yeah, I already in, went in here and did all this. Cool. All right. Uh, but let's go ahead and let's go put that in there. Where are we? Well, does this look like something that you guys can manage? It look pretty easy. Yeah, I think so. All right. We just gotta. We, I just gotta try to. I just gotta get some time to play around with it and see. Yeah. Well, I'm not trying to put it all on you guys. I'm just trying to save you money, and you guys, you know, oh yeah, we're handling your social media is honestly the best way to go. But if it's ever too much, just let me know. All right, I got your Instagram in there, Facebook. All right, I'm going to save that. I'll put your blog in there. Um, any competitors nearby? No. Any other chicken places nearby? Just mm. Chick-fil-A. Okay. Mm, be a hard There's nothing really in. like barbecue yeah. related. We're the only ones in that. That's why a lot of people are excited because there's nothing really around there. Really? All chicken, right. yeah. That's why I'm hoping that. This next week, the full week that we're open, I'm hoping it's going to take off really big. But the problem is a lot of people are uh, not able to find it. They're going to the old location. 
you know, and then and then someone had uh, someone Bob knows that had come by. He's like, yeah, I went to the website and it says Champs Chicken. One of our neighbors uh, thought we closed at seven because that when you log into Camps Chicken and when you go to the website, it goes to Champs Chicken. That picture. Oh yeah. And had like six a.m. to seven p.m. So. I think we got all that fixed. Um, but I don't know where it was. I think uh, I changed it on your Google listing. Um, we can go there and see. Okay, should I send you a picture of our road sign and stuff that you can update that picture? That that picture is like the old camp's chicken. Uh, well, yeah, we can do that. At hold on, real quick here. It's not very appealing, though. I know, but people get confused. Maybe. Mm -hmm. I mean, I can just we can just maybe... just take the picture down. Yeah, can we take that picture down? Yeah, let's uh. For the old camps, ours isn't that appealing. That's what my wife was saying. So it's not, you know. All right. Yeah, I just I got a million of them, so just had to get in there. Um, so that would be here. We can add our own pictures, is what I was going to say, and sync them across everywhere. But let's see. Um, you can add the photos here. Posts. You can see this is what used to get. This was the last thing posted um info let's just double check all this again it will sync up soon uh, 11 to 9 no that's what we originally put in website is right um all this will sync up pretty quick um photos 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 let's see there we go manage photos um obviously you want what which ones did you want to take away well the, the structure of the building because yeah, we're right. not in the same building yeah right there, we're not in that building anymore okay oh uh, that's somebody else i feel like I, I actually know her that's weird um she lives out of smith mount lake uh i can't take down or can i Uh, huh, it's an interesting situation. Not a photo of the place. Well, it's it's one that a customer posted. We didn't post it. Oh, so okay. that's the problem. Hmm. We're taking it down. Um, but let me see what we can do. Probably want to take that one down too, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Let's sixty-six. We'd kind of, what we need to do is get the new ones up of the building. Uh, hit it when the morning light hits the front of the building. Um, you see, there's suns up under here. Would be best. I don't know if that's evening or morning. When is it? That's probably morning. Yeah, morning at nine before nine a.m. If you can get a picture of it, kind of get low and shoot up at it. Um, I'll try to take this down. Let's let's try to let's try to take it down. Not a photo of the place. Uh, change locations. Gym, that camp's chicken grill. Um, well, that's not going to help. I don't think that's going to do it. I think what the I think what you have to do is what we do with a bad review is we just bury it with new pictures and we just need to get new pictures up ASAP of the new place. Is that the yeah, that's the, that's the old place. Um, yeah, we just need to post um, by owner. Here we go. Now, we don't have any by owner of the building. That's your customers. Okay. Exterior. Mm. Yeah, so that's all the exterior ones, huh? Yeah. We could ask her to take them down. Yeah, I do know her actually personally. <laughs> she knows she knows Jerry, so she must oh, have okay. just been visiting. Um, that would probably be what happened. Okay. Um, yeah. Any any. Uh, uh, yeah. So on Facebook, there is a automatic response that comes up uh, when somebody asks where we're located. Yeah. And it keeps giving out the old location. How do I get rid of that? Good question. Let's let's take care of it. 
um, integer. I'm trying to add GM here, and it's not letting me do it. Cancel. It's got me as. Oh, I see. Done. Let's just take care of this real quick to make sure that. There we go. GM at camps chicken. All right. And this will be owner invite. There you go. All right, Facebook. Yeah, let's do it. Um, hey. That's where it's, it's so um, let's do it. Facebook. Like somebody sent a message that went to Messenger and yep. Camp's Chicken automatically responded. And I came back and followed through with the new location address. Yeah. So that's over here in, um, it shouldn't do that. Here's your inbox. Is that, mm -hmm. that's the right one, right? Knoxville. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. Um, let's go back automated responses. Yep. So then you go in here, instant reply. Now I will pop this into your website. Okay. Um, so you'll have web chat in your website, much like, uh, here alpha male. Uh, has it? That's just one that came to my head. Um, so this will pop up right here in your website, right mm -hmm. there. So we'll take care of that. But that's where this is. Thanks. Not too soon. Opening Thursday, December six. That's not cool. Yep. Uh, thanks for missing us. That's the old Get one. Back to yep. you soon. So yeah, you need to. Thanks for messaging us. We'll get back to you soon. Let's keep that generic. Save. Um, frequently asked questions. Contact information. Is that the right number? Yes, yeah, same number. Okay, good. Location. There it is. Found it. Um, so somebody hand wrote this in here. Help me out. What is it? 7201. Chapman Highway. Can we add that we are between the Waffle House and the yep. Bayou Bay? Because then that's the next question. Chapman Highway, Knoxville. Uh, let me look at G between um, uh, Waffle House, House. And uh, Bay Bayou Bay Seafood. There you go. That uh, will take care of that. Nice. Uh, this is not right. Get directions. Yeah, this is another problem right here. Let's. Fix what does that this. say? Uh, that is directions. So let's. Mm -hmm. Let's get that fixed. Camps chicken. Uh, directions. Yeah, how come that still comes up the old location? Where? That's not the old oh, location. it's just the picture. Okay. Yeah, we, we do need to delete that. You're right. Um, yeah, well, crap, I might have taken that photo. Um, I can move it down. Uh, I mean, I took all those photos that you see in the video and stuff. Um, all right, Knoxville Highway. Let me see here. There should be a way. Directions. How do I? Uh, send your phone. Do this. Hopefully, it goes to my phone now. Guess not. All right. Oh, let's see if it came to my phone. 
you get a apps. I just might get the Google Maps link though. Huh, still didn't come to my phone. Let me see if I can get the link the other way. Hold on. Camps. Thanks for your patience, guys. No problem. A little out of out of directions. Okay. Shoot. A lot of intricate. Huh? Very intricate. Yeah. It's very detailed. Yeah. Yeah. It's directions here. Where is my share button right here? Directions. I'll be there in four hours. <laughs> Where's my share at? Share, finally. Okay, I'm going to text that link. There you go. Just sent it to Jam. So that's the link I'm looking for right there. Houston. Uh, copy. And let's get that right. Now I will give people directions. Save. So that's all you do is just go through here and make sure everything. I mean, if they ask for hours. Um, you can edit that message. Uh, we're That's open. all under automated response. Yeah. Come in here in your message box. And uh, I'll show you some other things real quick. Um, see hours. That will show your hours. Uh, we're open Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, 9. Now, again, just because you did that in Go Agency doesn't mean it's going to upgrade here because that's automated messages, but it will update the hours on Facebook. Okay. Okay. You have to manually come in here nine. Oh, it's 11 a.m. Sorry. To nine, right? Mm -hmm. All right. Um, cool. That's a save. Uh, job application. It's a great place to get job applications. I know it's kind of hard right now. Um, I turn this on too. No, I wouldn't. Uh, okay. Oh, let me tell you some other things. Appointment reminders. No page recommended. No page. Don't, uh, don't do that. Um, the chat plugin, I'll hook up Instagram. You're already connected. Um, I'm mm -hmm. going to, I'm going to get you access to, um, I'll email you guys, uh, passwords for that. And I'll change the password like I did for Instagram. So you'll be good to go. Uh, when you want to upgrade the tool, I think it'd probably be a wise idea in social media. Uh, Twitter is good for some SEO value. Um, Instagram's a must for anybody under 30, really. Um, you know, they're not on Facebook. So um, <laughs> thank you for that. Yeah. I appreciate uh, it. And I'm, I'm, I'm 48 or 47. I don't know, but yeah, I had to deal with it. So, um, so yeah, that's everything here. Let's just double check the page rolls again. Um, you probably want to make, uh instagram whatsapp there's a page rolls must be getting too late for me there it is page rolls i think we checked this already jam you and i did uh yeah if you need to add anybody here you can make them an editor put in there i think you know, got rid of whoever was on there yeah we got rid of so it's just me and okay cool um cool. all right uh last thing i want to tell you um on your reviews when you're logging into go agency um, okay, competitors, marketing, SEO keywords, hold on, we need to finish this chicken, um, barbecue, which, what's the right way to spell barbecue again? I'm always confused, barbecue, B-A-R-B-E-Q-E-Q-U-E, -E. right, chicken, uh, we want to add soy chicken, uh, what, do, what's another big Bar one? Ours is actually smoked chicken, so I don't know if barbecue or smoke. I mean, it's probably the same thing. It's all right? the same. Smoked chicken. Uh, let's 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 do that right there. Let's get these voice keywords in. Um, what other ones can we do? Oh, you know what we got to do? Camps. 
chicken and grill and grill. Okay. Um, let's do that up here too. This is important. Let's add one more here. Let's add one more here. What other voice would people uh, search search for? Like voice world, uh, Knoxville, chicken Knoxville, maybe. Um, yeah, quite chicken. Um, Knoxville, chicken Knoxville. Uh, smoked chicken barbecue Knoxville. Why don't we switch those words around? Smoke barbecue. That way we pick get them all. Chicken Knoxville. Let's see. Let's go bigger. Or Tennessee? Nah. All right. So that's saved. Um, media. Uh, yeah, we could add. This is where we'd add the photos we want, and then it would push it to Facebook and all these other listings. Okay. Um, invite users. If you got somebody else, another employee, you want to have access to the tool, we can do that here. Or just let me know. Um, okay. And if you have any questions, let me know. I can jump on a Zoom and show you um, anything there. Uh, this executive report will come. I I totally expect, you know, to see this thing filled out and like, especially in the listings right now, like the website will get up to an A. Um, the accuracy things will go away once we get everything consistent in the listing and push it. Um, and this is just some nice data that will come to you every month. Um, and I'll, we'll be working on this next time we meet to just get all this in, in you know, we're, we're yeah, I like deep. the I like the nightly review thing. I get excited when I get the five star review. Like you know, somebody right. went there and did the review. That's pretty cool. Good point, man. That's what I wanted to talk about next. Um, so if you ever get a bad review, which will happen, I mean, mm. I, you are the only one that I ever seen not get a bad review. Okay, so anything. Uh, so mm. if you do, I mean, honestly, you were. I was. I'm really impressed with that, the way you did that, and I've, I've got several. So, uh, you know, tons of, of restaurants here on this. Um, the trick is don't get into a conversation with them right there. Say, hey, call us or give them your cell or put, put, the, put your GM email and work it out with them. Give and give them like a free app. Listen to them. Call them, whatever, because um, okay. it does make a difference. You know, some people are unruly and, and, and if you can't help. You can't please every customer. Fine. But at least say, hey. You know, if I were to give you a free app, would you change your change your score at least to a four or something, right? Um, you know, and, and, and that's how you do that. Okay, don't don't do it on the review, and it actually will prompt you um, when you if you get a bad review, it will give you a. Let me see if I can if I can go to another one real quick. Uh, yeah. So this one's I know struggling with some stuff. So here's kind of a look at the pro version. Um, so a three. Let me see if they got a bad one yeah. here. Mm -hmm. uh, I know they had a bad one, but it, it basically says email us. Appreciate the feedback. Uh, and, and, and get it off of here. Don't try. Does that make sense? Don't have yeah. a, a conversation with them. I also have something on my website, too, um, about that. I'll send it to you. It'll be coming in an email. But um, all right. Uh, any other questions for me that I can help you guys with? I think that's it for now. Yeah. I think we're okay for mm -hmm. that one, yeah. As soon as that website goes live, um, we'll get you on another one of these. I'll show you how to edit that. That's super easy. Or I can make all the changes. I'll, I'll, I'll go ahead and make, let me check and see if it's up now. Because they literally told me it would. Nope. Okay. Um, so yeah, we'll be looking for that. I'll be pressing hard. So the, web, it, the website's going to be under Camp's Chicken, right? No. And not Camp's we, Chicken and Grill? No. We lost campschicken.com to some guy okay. in China who wants yeah. two, three grand for it. <laughs> and that was Derek. He, he didn't change his credit card. And then they called yeah. me a month. But how come, but how come when I go on Google and I put Cam's chicken, it comes up, but then the address is ours. Everything is ours. Because we changed it. We are Cam's chicken. The domain doesn't make us Cam's chicken. Okay. We make the domain. We I tell guess. people what website to go. Now, oh. that guy stole the domain. Now, look, if they would have just contacted me 
really you got 60 days to reclaim your domain. They called me literally the day after I could reclaim the domain. I was so pissed. I was just like, are you kidding me? Your site's been down for two months and you're just now calling me. I think it was Michelle. Who was it? Um, I think Michelle. Yeah. Yeah. And I was just like, are you guys serious? And then I contacted the guy. He was a complete jerk. He was in China and he, uh, yeah, he's just holding it hostage. He knew what he had gotten. He knew it was a viable business. And so I guess he sold it to this, when you go there now, 